Hi, I'm John Brownbridge. It's my wife, Nee Brownbridge. We met around eight and a half years ago and a very ambitious couple. My wife, uh, she, she received her doctorate in forensic psychology. She's an MFT. Uh, she pushed me to also get my doctorate um, in education, organizational leadership, and that was our focus. And we've got three young kiddos, uh, but we were very driven along the lines of, uh, of our careers. And then April 29th happened. Prior to April 29th, I was uh, visiting the hospital, I think about three times prior to go uh, to see a doctor to see what's going on with me. Um, I had a lot of pain in my abdomen. I had a lot of pain in my back. They diagnosed me with pancreatic cancer. It had metastasized everywhere in my body, throughout my bones, in my liver, uh, my mm. lymph nodes, everywhere. And so there was a very low s a chance of survival. They pretty much summed it up to he had to prepare for me to pass away. And so I think he just decided to make the best of the time that we had and we traveled. Um, I was well enough to travel in between the treatments, so we traveled a lot and it was amazing. It was an amazing time with our kids and our kids didn't know any difference. You know, they're so happy. The diagnosis was awful. The lead doctors at Kaiser, City Pope, Cedar sinai they were surprised she was still with us the day of the appointments. You know, that being said, um, having reflection on that, the career doesn't matter that much. Um, how much time you spend doing, uh, you know, going, it, it's important, but it's not everything. So having balance of life uh, and, and, and understanding what your relationships are so important with God, because for me, it was so difficult. I had to let go and just trust God. Okay, it's in your hands. So October 18th, I think it was, John and I were eating at a taco stand and we got a call from my doctor. He said, you know, I'm looking at the scans and I don't know what happened or how it happened, but there's no cancer in the images. And that day was such a relief. And um, I just felt like I had a new lease on life. Not only did we have respective change as far as our careers, you know, it adjusted that completely. Life is so short and priorities need to be organized a certain way. And my wife getting this diagnosis was absolutely a life changer for us. And we love each other so much more deeply now because of it. And uh, it's crazy to think that having to go through so the trauma that we're going through and have gone through would be a benefit. But I think once we relied on God and let it go and trusted the process, so to speak. Um, it has changed our lives completely. John really has seen a change in my faith and has grown so much. I talk about Jesus all the time. I talk to strangers about him and I tell them about the miracle that has happened. You don't need to be Downing Thomas like me. You can be someone who hears the childlike faith, that hears and believes and is able to understand and apply it. God is good, love your family, love God, and, and, and just enjoy life uh, because it's gonna be gone very soon.